Now, I do know Zealous known for being a very, very punish-heavy Marth, and it does look like Zealous is actually going to use his Marth here uh, as Toph finally join, re rejoins, well, rejoins me. What's up, dude? Hey, what's up, man? I just hey. I figured I had enough time to go get water. What's up, guys? <laughs> Welcome to the Melee stream. Yo, let's go, Zealous. I know, right? So, Zelly actually plays Fox a lot. Zelly? Zelly? <laughs> okay. Hey man, that's what that's what people call him. Zelly plays uh, Fox a lot in this mark in this matchup beforehand, but I it looks like he's going Marth now. So you almost said cool. Martha. Martha? You, that? you were gonna say he plays Fox in this matchup, and you said in this you Martha. Said in this Ooh, Martha. yeah, yeah. That's Yo, what you call him Martha. Oh. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. He's doing a real like his game plan looks really solid though. You you would. That's, that's <laughs> actually he almost grabbed it. The way he's playing though, because he's he's doing two things. He's going for the pivot tippers, really important. He's doing the chain grabs as well when he gets grabbed. Yeah. And he's doing the dash grabs. And those are all like practiced Marth versus Puff things. Mm -hmm. So that's really interesting that he goes Fox because yeah, it, it seems like he wouldn't even really need to. That was yeah, I think he switched off a bit in the past. I haven't paid attention recently, but you're right. Stuff like that, even the the dash grabs, which is something that like execution wise, not mm -hmm. that hard, but it's something you have to practice, right? It's a whole different mentality just to, Very different, to yeah. do that. That being said, though, I mean H box, like <laughs> he's uh, God, he really. I don't know what it is. Oh. There, it's almost like yes, he like this whole and he still has the aggression, like he yeah. still has the advantage. He gets a hit and he gets like a three or four hit combo. Yeah. And he's just so good at sharking Marth and like making the Marth feel super uncomfortable. You watch this and like, look, Zelsa is standing in the corner and you're like freaking out. Like, oh my God, Zelsa's gonna oh die. Oh my God, oh my Zelsa's God, Xbox, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Yeah, I totally right? agree with you. Yeah. That's crazy. That's the sort of stuff that kept it even when he played Zane, right, at Shine. But, but something that we noticed actually in this set already is Z Zealous went for, no, no, when, when uh, I, I meant Shine, when, mm. when yeah, yeah, because he, he kept it even even though he ended up losing, right? Got it. But, but at Shine, what we saw was that Xbox didn't quite know the DI for the pivot tippers and stuff. Right. Uh, Zealous went for a pivot tipper earlier, and Hbox actually DI'd it away correctly, and so didn't get hit by it. Is it Gar now? You know, I should really know this as a <laughs> seasoned, you know, melee commentator. Sure, sure. But uh, is it guaranteed for Puff to get out, or is it like a DI mix-up? It's a DI mix-up. Yeah. Mix -up, so right? it's it's a DI mix-up between forward throw and down throw, and with uh, pivot tipper, wave dash for like uh, yeah, pivot tipper, wave yeah, dash yeah, yeah. forward tipper. Okay. And you can even do like some down smash stuff. If it's all coming back to me. I remember Kadano made this That's handy, sick chart, the right? and it's yeah, super yeah, yeah. duper complicated. Yeah, it is. What you're supposed to do for every single DI. Yeah. You guys can. Oh my god, I wish someone could like, pull it up. Someone should like link it in the wall. Well, okay, Never mind. We're going to say anything. We're going to game two. Hungry Box versus Zealous. Yeah, so even though Zealous had a good game plan, like you said, a game plan's not the only thing you need against Hungry Box. Oh! Oh my god. god. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, you have to execute uh, so precisely, and like that's you know one thing Zane can really do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Zane also just has such incredible patience in this matchup. Like, doesn't over oh. ever. That was <laughs> that was gorgeous spacing from Zealous. Yeah, let's go, hey. Zealous. Let's go. Let's go, Zealous. That was really sick. That was the way he dodged those two pounds. I swear to God, like that pound is such a hard move to space. Oh, that stays out so long, and you know that if Hbox had gotten that, it would have been one of those absurd three-piece combos you were talking about. Exactly. Right? Exactly. Um, yeah, it's super active, and it's like a little bit bigger than it looks. Uh huh. And then you shield it, and half your shield goes away, and you feel so bad. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is wow! That was awesome. That was a sick recovery. Hbox mm -hmm. gonna turn it around again, but oh wow! <laughs> what was that? Was it opposite tech on like a reverse four tilt? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, that was super long. Okay. Zealous' recovery has been really good, but he hasn't managed to get back to center stage after them exactly. He's getting like ledge trapped. Yeah, he is. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna appropriate some terminology here yeah, from Ultimate. Man. He's getting ledge trapped. It's a really useful term. It is. It is. It's just it doesn't happen as much in this game because most characters have just much better ledge options. But uh, but Marth's one of the characters who he can bat you away at the ledge, but in terms of invincible options off the ledge, he's pretty limited. He is. Okay. Oh, and he gets. Ah, the DI, see, yeah. So that's DI down and away. So Zealous needed to do walk, wave dash, wave dash forward, F smash there. Yeah. Or he needed to go for a down throw mix up. Makes sense. Yeah. Oof. Oh my god, the way Hbox lands. You never know. No. He literally, like, it looks it, like if you watch him, it's like, you know, just punish his landing, right? He's got to land at some point. But right. He makes it so difficult to tell how and when he's going to land. And so many of the things that he throws out, like those bears there above Zealous, not doing too, too much, but if Zealous had tried to get frisky with it, tried to do like a full mm. hot bear or something, that's keeping Hbox safe, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh! Jeez, 
I, uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you see that forward smash. Maybe you just dash that up. Yeah. Oh, oh, point. oh. Wow. Nice. nice. Yeah, yeah. That's how Zane killed him in China to win yeah, the tournament. I remember that. <laughs> I remember that. Whole lot of first hit, first hit side Bs with no follow up. Then finally he realized he had two hits. Yeah. All right, but HBox with the lead. Just playing like, you know, the classic HBox versus Marth where he really makes you work for. Okay, yep. Every time Zealous overextends and goes for a hit that he shouldn't have, HBox is so content to just take a trade or something because he's in the lead. Mm -hmm. Slowly building. Wow, yeah, reverse back. He actually caught Zealous without a jump there. Oh my god. Yeah, Zell, you see Zealous when he does that wave dash back, he's actually looking for an opportunity to. Oh. There you Screen go. flickered for a moment. Of, I didn't see what happened, but I guess Zealous missed the ledge dash. Yeah, I missed his ledge dash right there. All right, I'm going to tweet out the, the stream now that I have a little.